but that's life i mean like all i can do right now is just pick up whatever is left and live the rest of my life You're better off not giving the small things more time than they deserve. How many times have you actually traded something, something important over something that's really small? Something that you think that someday, say you're on your deathbed, that you're not going to say that that's a thing that you really wanted to do. Like if you're going to spend the last one hour of your life and you're going to say that it's not even worth it of doing. Here are a few things that you can consider to change in your life. If you're going to reduce the amount of time you're going to put in these activities, it's going to change your life. Have you ever found yourself binging on Netflix or any TV program? Just imagine the amount of information that you can get from books, from reading, from learning a new skill, from whichever things that you think is worth learning. Knowledge is going to grow your mind, not only your mind, but also your soul. It's going to grow your relationship. It's going to build your career. It's going to make you a better person. But you keep on trading that off for your time for TV, for that time that you're going to watch that favorite program that doesn't bring you anything or any benefit at all. If you want to change, monitor your time. If you want to change, minimize the time that you spend on TV. These are one of the small things that really doesn't matter that much. Your time on social media. Since social media had came up, people had gobbled it like crazy. Like a lot of people, and I'll be an example for myself. The moment I open a social media platform, whichever that is, I'm saying to myself, I'm just going to spend like five minutes browsing on this social media platform. And you know what happens? I'll see myself like spending the whole hour, if not the whole day, like literally, like just lying there. It's so sad. Humanity has brought us technology so that we can deliver news faster, you know, disseminate information at the speed of light. We're actually using it for the sake of entertainment. And not only entertainment, useless entertainment. Rubbish. Social media is a small thing, but we're trading it off for bigger things that we can do. I'm sure that this is something that everybody is guilty about. It's about food. And food is life. Everybody loves to eat food. The problem is, what kind of food do you eat? What is your selection of nutrition that goes into your body? Now, some people would say, oh, I'm just going to eat some chips now. You open a bag, and just like the slogan says, once you pop, you can't stop. I'm not endorsing it, okay? but it happens like when you open something up, you just finish it. And it's a small thing. We are trading off our health for eating rubbish, for eating trash. Your mind is fixated on small pleasures, on small things. And end of the day, it's your health on the line. Relationships that doesn't matter. How many times have you been invited over by your mom or your dad to an occasion wherein you're supposed to come? It's a small family gathering 
and you were expected to come and you have traded that for a party for a friend whom you think is that it's just a small thing I, I'd skip on this I'd skip on this family affair so that I could actually please a friend a friend that most likely would not be there at the time that you're really at need And if you will think, if it's your parents who's asking you to be there, come over. These are people who's got, who's already lived their life. Your parents has already lived their lives. And whatever that they're enjoying right now, they've already passed the prime of their lives. And the only expectation they have of their children is to be there for them that you would be there for them. Family is the biggest thing in our life. I've missed a lot of events in my life. I would say that I had a lot of regrets. If I could have just traded off more time to family, I would have went further I, I might have collected more joy in my life but that's life I mean like all I can do right now is just pick up whatever is left and live the rest of my life and I hope you too can pick up something from this when's the last time that you have traded your day off your rest day whatever you call it for a day of sleep a day of slumber do you know that you spent one third of your life sleeping <laughs> you have traded a small thing over experience and there's something that these experiences can actually bring you some good memories in the future and you know what's the fuel of an old man? An old man is fueled by memories. By the time that you are not able to stand up anymore, say if you're an old guy on a rocking chair, like you're no longer agile, you're no longer mobile, the only thing that can keep you going would be your memories the happy experiences you had in your life so go out get the best experience ever whatever that we're doing right now is more pleasurable than the bigger things that we can do in life so stop wasting your time and start living once again, this is Restful Codes, and I thank you for watching this video. Peace. If you like the video you just watched, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. And don't forget to smash that like button. A little bit of support coming from you is well appreciated. Thank you for watching.